Hello, this is Brian Scuttle from Sonic Cinema. I'm here with a quick take. Uh, it's been a while since I've done one, um, mainly because I haven't really had much to say about some of the other movies that I've been catching up with, but and others that I've just been writing main reviews for. Uh, but we are on screener season now, uh, officially, and I start out by finally checking out Molly Gordon and Nick Lieberman's uh, Theater to Camp on Hulu. And it is a film in the mockumentary form about a uh, theater camp, for lack of a better term, in uh, New York that is where the owner and the proprietor has landed in a coma watching one of their students uh, because of some strobe lighting. And her son is taking over and trying to keep it afloat and finding it very, very difficult to do. And we get to see some of the counselors uh, in the, in the uh, camp. We see them working with the students, working towards different productions, seeing how they uh, speak, and it's it's very much a fly on the wall in the tradition of this is Smile Tap, Wayne for Guffman, Best in Show, the Christopher Guest movies, basically any uh, movie or TV show that incorporates that uh, genre of comedy. This was a truly hilarious film. Uh, I had never been a theater kid. I'd never been somebody who was enamored by performance, but I do remember theatrical performance, but I do remember what it was like when we would go to marching band camp every year. And, you know, there are elements of it that bleed over, but this is... This is very much a different beast, and it's very theatric. It's very hilarious in how goofy some of the dialogue is, how some of the songs are. And uh, because the the main uh, composers on the camp who are teachers, played by, played by Ben Platt and Molly Gordon, are creating an original musical based on the life of Joan, who is the uh, proprietor of the camp, who is in a coma. And that is that is where the humor, musical humor comes into play a great deal. There's, there are fantastic performances all around. I, I, I loved watching this movie from time, from the uh, time it started to the time it ended. There's some terrific music. Uh, you know, the uh, final song uh, is definitely on my short list. list as far as the Oscars, I would love to see it get nominated. Um, I I just really enjoyed the movie as a comedy. If you if you're a fan of the Christopher Guest mockumentaries, uh, if you're a fan of theater, if you're a fan of music and musicals. I, I think it's one that's definitely worth checking out. And it's on Hulu. It's very easy to uh, watch. And it's one that I've been wanting to get to for a while. And I'm glad I did because it was really a delightful film. And uh, those are my thoughts on Theater Camp. And uh, I will be doing more of these quick takes on movies that I catch up with as screener season goes along as I get ready to... Uh, cast my own ballot for Georgia Film Critics Association. Uh, this is going to be an interesting end of the year, and I cannot wait to see it, how it unfolds for me as far as my uh, best, as far as favorites, and hopefully there are some movies I can rewatch before I uh, finalize my list, but we'll see how that goes. That's going to be it for this uh, Song Cinema Quick Take of Theater Camp. This is Brian Scuttle. Thank you very much for following me on the Sonic Cinema Podcast YouTube channel as well as www 
thatsonic-cinema.com. Thank you.